Hi friends, in the last video we covered very clearly how to handle exceptions by using try catch. So within the try, risky code, inside catch block we have to write handling code. It's very clear. Now my next thing, very important, very interesting sir. What is control flow in try catch block? Observe, observe this one, control flow inside try catch. Okay, here observe try block is there in that statement 1, statement 2, statement 3. Total how many statements are there inside try block sir? 3 statements are there. Catch block x, x, x. It can be any exception. Sir, statement 4. Sir, after completing catch block, statement 5 is there sir. Okay, like total 5, 5 statements are there where I use a try catch also. Now my question is, if an exception rises at statement 1, what will happen? Statement 2, what will happen? Statement 3, what will happen? 4, what will happen? 5. Like uh, each and every statement, if an exception rises, uh, what is the flow we have to give it? So most of your doubts also will be clarified from this basic flow. Just uh, take a bit special care to understand, sir. Sir, first case, multiple cases I will discuss. First case, if uh, there is no exception, sir, exception not rises at runtime, can you please tell which statements will be executed, sir? 1, 2, 3 will be executed normally. 1, 2, 3. Catch block won't be executed. Are you getting catch block won't be executed because there is no exception. If there is no exception, catch is not going to execute. Sir, catch. Now, statement 5. Statement 5 and then normal termination. Sir, is it normal or abnormal? If there is no exception, obviously normal termination. Take very special care. If there is no exception, so except the catch block, all the remaining statements will be executed normally. This is the case one. Now case two, sir. If an exception rises yet a statement two. If an exception rises yet a statement two, and the corresponding catch block matched. If an exception rises at statement 2, here exception rises and the corresponding catch block means matched, matched, corresponding catch block matched. What will happen? Now take very special care. One will be executed normally. One will be executed normally. But while executing two, the problem came, some exception rises. Immediately corresponding catch block is there. Now, statement 4 executed. Yeah, take very special care. After statement 4, either statement 3, remaining part of try block, will be executed or not. Ayo, respond. Very important. For most of the students here, there is a doubt. Compulsory, you should have clear clarity. Sir, now, statement 2, there is a problem. Catch block executed. After executing catch block, now statement 3 will be executed or not. Okay. Remember a bit very carefully. Inside try block, we have to write the main flow. Main flow. Of course, there is key code main flow. If there is any problem is coming, then immediately catch block. Immediately catch block contain alternative flow alternative flow will be executed right now in the main flow if you are facing the problem then immediately alternative flow executed after executing alternative flow what the need of going back to the train are getting suppose if the bus ticket is not available then i will try for the train ticket once you got the train ticket are you going to try for the bus ticket again no that's why so within the try block, if an exception rises, control came to catch block. After executing catch block, the control never go back to try block, sir. Remaining code will be executed normally. So inside the try block, if any at any statement an exception rises, even though you handle that exception, you handle that exception. Rest of the try block is not going to be executed. Take very special care, sir. That's why, do you know, statement 1 executed. Now 2, the problem, corresponding catch block matched. If the corresponding catch block matched, 
immediately statement 4 will be executed after the regular remaining statements will execute 5 followed by normal termination 1 1 next while 2 the problem 4 and then 5 normal termination that's what you should aware sir very very important conclusion inside a try block if an exception raised sir even you handle that exception rest of the try block never going to be executed that's why inside the try block we have to take only risky code but not the normal code remember that sir most of the people do you know most of the people are having worst kind of programming approach approach they followed sir what that is assume that assume i have one program class test is there sir public static void main method is there string array accept do you know almost around uh, 10,000 lines of the code is there sir how many how many lines of the code inside main method 10,000 lines of the code is there 10,000 lines of the code is there sir now if anywhere the problem is coming most of the people what they are going to do is sir we will take a uh, try block here and uh, at last the uh, catch block they will write uh, at last uh, sir catch uh, some exception here like end of the main line so total 10,000 lines of the code they will keep inside a try block inside a single try and then catch block right it is a very worst kind of programming practice what the reason for that is suppose unfortunately yet line number one only exception raised sir yet line number one exception raised uh, immediately the control will comes to catch block sir with the rest of the try block is not going to be executed without executing 9999 lines of the code sir without executing these many lines of the code how the what is the use of executing catch block that's why inside the try block we have to take only risky code but not normal code length of the try block should be as less as possible very very important sir then immediately you may have sir multiple risky areas are there inside my main method okay like uh, here this is my code here one risky area here also one risky area here also one risky area is there multiple risky areas are there there don't take a total sir total thing inside a single try what you have to take better to take a try try and then catch block here try catch block next uh, try and then catch block here try catch block next uh, try and then catch block so for every risky area you can take separate try block separate try catch separate try catch this type of thing is recommended but don't include normal code inside a try block the length of the try block should be as less as possible remember this good programming practices right but anyway as per our requirement okay inside a try block if anywhere an exception raised rest of the try block won't be executed even though we handle that exception are you clear for all of you right up to this so that's all this is the case 2 sir now case 3 if an exception raised yet a statement 2 sir here an exception raised and the corresponding catch block not matched sir there is no corresponding catch block sir here riser exception is arithmetic exception but uh, this catch block for null pointer exception so the problem riser he is a uh, heart problem but uh, doctor is available eye specialist is available are you are you getting right so riser problem arithmetic exception but uh, here catch block is available for null pointer exception the corresponding catch block not matched if the corresponding catch block not matched not matched it is always abnormal termination remember this one sir it's always abnormal termination that's why one followed by abnormal termination remaining code never going to execute sir after one at statement two only the problem will be stopped the program will be stopped by raising that exception are you in the position to understand up to this right next the fourth one sir if an exception raised yet a statement 4 or statement 5 take very special care sir now statement 4 is available inside catch block are you getting statement 4 is available inside catch block catch block sir 
sir first thing what you should aware don't feel exceptions will be riser only in the tri block exceptions may be a chance of rising inside catch block inside finally blocks also exception don't feel it's always going to be riser only in the tri block inside catch catch also contain java code only finally also contain java code only so anywhere there is a possibility to rise an exception next up one more very important thing sir suppose i have tri block is there now there are some statements are there sir okay there are some statements are there now catch block is there <coughs> assume that catch block is there like here if if there is a problem among these lines anywhere so if there is a problem among these lines anywhere anywhere immediately the corresponding catch block will execute so this catch block acts as guard guard to these try statements right suppose here here there is a, there is a problem at statement 1 outside of try can you please confirm is this catch block is the responsible for that no no this catch block responsible to handle exceptions which are riser because of try block statements only so catch is always associated with the try but not for the remaining statements okay if there is a problem at a statement 1 there is a problem at a statement 1 statement 1 do you know this catch block is not responsible to handle it is always abnormal termination best example sir for your house sir, you kept one security person if there is any problem is coming in a, in, in your house sir, maybe some robbery or no oh, okay like maybe maybe some robbers are coming like your security person can handle can handle sir suppose there is a problem in the neighbor's house sir, your security person is not responsible are you getting right this catch block responsible only for these statement okay only for the try block statements not for the remaining statements so the conclusion is if any statement which rises an exception if any statement which rises an exception exception outside of try block outside of try block then catch blocks are not responsible it is always abnormal termination remember that sir okay now sir here this statement is it inside the try block or outside try block outside try block so these are the only things sir, inside the try are you getting these statements are inside try but this catch block statement outside the try outside the try are you getting if any statement rises an exception which is not the inside the try block then it is always abnormal termination so if any statement rises exception inside catch block believe me it is always abnormal termination then sir you may ask how you can handle simple inside catch block you can take again try catch again try catch possible possible sir by using this one if you want you can handle okay like now have you come back to our scenario sir inside catch block if there is an exception raised it is a not the part of try statement that's why it is always abnormal termination are you getting right so because it is not there inside the try abnormal termination can you please tell if there is an exception raised at statement 5 if an exception rises at statement 5 is it normal termination or abnormal termination please confirm is it normal or abnormal termination abnormal because it is not part of statement it is not part of try block okay if any statement rising an exception not a part of try block it is always abnormal termination that's why if an exception rises at a statement 4 or statement 5 it is always abnormal termination you should aware even in the next classes also i will i will use this concept so that's why you have to aware clearly right so at 1 or 2 or 3 anywhere problem is coming then if the catch block matched it will execute if the catch block not matched abnormal termination inside catch block if an exception rises abnormal termination sir outside try catch block if an exception rises here abnormal termination next the length of try block should be as less as possible okay normal code don't try to include inside try block because inside try block if anywhere an exception rises then the rest of the try block is not going to be executed even though you handle that exception that's why 
triplet length should be as less as possible. Clear right? Sir, all these things are included in our material. Happily just go through so that you people can feel more comfortable, right? Clear for all of you, right?